This one has a built-in neck brace. So, what do you think? What do you guys like? You like the over the jersey, under the jersey? Do you like neck brace or no neck brace? Are you a mannequin? Let's start things off with, there's a couple of shout outs that we wanna give, but first, I gotta say that, are you look comfortable, Luke? Yeah. Good, you look comfortable. Yeah. I'm glad. A couple things that we wanna say. First, it is November. It is a very special time right now. November is a time when we take our pumpkins and we roll them down a hill and try to throw them off a cliff. Nice! So that's what we're going to do right now. We're going to go launch our pumpkins off a cliff, but first, we've got two shout outs that we need to give. One shout out is to Simon Garcia. Simon came up with a really good idea. I didn't like it at first. At first, I didn't think it was that great of an idea, but as I thought about it, it kind of grew on me, and now I think it's a great idea because we've been getting a ton of shout out requests, and to be honest with you, I just can't keep up with them. I can't keep up with all the shout out requests. So he came up with an idea that the first five comments on each video get a shout out on the following video. So starting now, starting today, first five people to leave a comment on this video are going to get, no, Lily, that's $25. I can't afford that. You're gonna get a shout out on the next video. So hurry and comment something and be in the top five. The second shout out is to Jordy. Jordy came up with a really good idea because we've got these we got these two little KTM 50 dirt bikes that have a really small exhaust and our exhaust plugs do not fit. So when we wash our bikes, it's really hard to plug the exhaust pipe in order to keep the water from getting into the exhaust. So Jordy came up with a really good idea. He said to put a Nerf gun bullet in the exhaust to keep the water from going in there. That's genius. That is such a good idea. It fits perfectly. So thanks for that idea. The only problem is you gotta have a really good aim to shoot the bullet inside. You ready to go first? Yeah. I'm gonna go second. Bye bye, please, please. <laughs> okay. Where? I'll go. Uh, Here, oh, video me. I'm just gonna pretend this is Mason. I did. You just ruined the pumpkin, Luke. See if you can roll it, roll it, roll it down the um down the road. Okay, go. Uh, faster than that, Luke. No, oh. like okay, a bowling it. ball. No, <laughs> like this. Bye bye, pumpkin. Thank you for making our home spooky. Look, before you throw that one, let's show it off a little bit. This was Luke's pumpkin. This won uh, several pumpkin carving awards. You notice the scarring, the nice detail above the eye? It's that's, a pumpkin. That's fantastic, Luke. That is a work of art right there. It's about to go off the hill. Ready? Here we go. Ha ha ha!
yellow pumpkins down there. Okay, Mason and you do the last one. Ready? Mason, not. Find my pumpkin that it's snowing up here. Look. Well, good job, guys. You did well. Guys, you see the trail of pumpkin. called the floss. The floss? I guess you could tell the dentist you do floss then. So we've been getting a lot of comments from people saying that I should get Luke a chest protector pretty much ever since he launched himself into the tree at Larry's house. Oh. But what I don't think people understand is that Luke has abs of steel. Like he doesn't need a plastic chest protector because he's got total steel right here. Look at, look at that. That's even better than a chest protector, right? I'm just kidding. Okay, so we're gonna look at chest protectors, Luke. What do you think? I like Is that it. good? Yeah. I, I kind of like this one, the Alpine Star. It's got like a kidney belt built into it. Do you like, you like that one better or do you like the other one better? Probably this one. You like that one better? You don't like it? I like it. You do like it? Yeah. So there's a few different types of chest protectors. There's like an under the jersey one, there's an over the jersey one, and then this one, Luke, this one has a built-in neck brace. So what do you think? What do you guys like? You like the over the jersey, under the jersey? Do you like neck brace or no neck brace? Are you a mannequin? Hello? All right guys, thanks for watching. I really hope that there was some part of this video that you liked. And just as a reminder, hey Mason. Hey. Mason bumped his eye. Can you guys say sorry about your eye? All right guys, one more time, just a reminder, if you want a shout out, all you gotta do is be one of the first five comments and we are going to give you a shout out in the next video. And we're not just gonna give you a shout out, we're also gonna read your comment in the video. So don't just comment first, or nice video, or you suck, or something like that. Actually like say something interesting so that we could read your comment to everybody. Say something like about yourself, or where you're from, or what you like, or what you liked about the video, or that Luke has nice abs, or something like that. I think that'll be fun. Those are the Halloween decorations. I guess we forgot to throw those down the hill. Lillian! You gotta put the Halloween decorations away. It's, it's November now, or not. Lastly, we're gonna end with a motivational ending. If you ever need to hide a body, make sure you dig a grave that's 12 feet deep. Throw the body in, and then put six feet of dirt on top of the body. And then you get like a, a large dog, like a St. Bernard or like a Great Dane. Probably not a Great Dane, like a St. Bernard would probably be better. Great Danes are big, but they're also kind of like scrawny. Like a St. Bernard or like a Mastiff. And then you put that on top. And then you put another six feet of dirt on top of the dog. And no one will find the body. It's Ray! It's Ray! Action. Yes, that's what action means. Dad, you forgot to flush the toilet again! What is that? Action! Dad, you forgot to flush the toilet again! Action! Dad, you forgot to flush the toilet again! <laughs> hey, you already hit her once.